Thank you. Happening right now, united efforts by thousands of workers to get the money and benefits they feel they deserve. No deals, no, no wills. No deals, no, no wills. United Auto Workers are no off the assembly no line deals. and now in the street. The strike began nearly two weeks ago. It shows no sign of ending. Metro Atlanta doesn't have any automotive plants, but it does have other industries impacted by the UAW strike. Atlanta News First, Brittany Ford reports from a parts plant in Morrow. Well, there are about 100 union workers here at this auto parts distribution center in Morrow that have walked off the job. Now, if a deal isn't reached anytime soon, this could lead to a nationwide shortage of auto parts and more expensive auto repairs. No, no wheels. wheels, no deals, no, no wheels. wheels. Mark Miller Jr. is a third generation auto worker. No deals, no, no wheels. wheels. My great grandfather uh, is a retiree from General Motors. I have a great uncle as a retiree from General Motors. I have a lot of family members that work for the big three. No deals, no, no wheels. Wheel. Miller no leading the picket lines no at the deals, local no 686 no union, deals, no reliving wheel. a battle. No deals, no, no wheels. Wheel. His family in the auto industry have seen time and time again. Definitely a little bit uneasy. I mean, right now we're demanding a better contract, uh, pension, COLA, um, more money, um, just a better way of living. You know, corporate greed uh, is at its finest right now. Union workers at the Salantis warehouse in Morrow <laughs> joining an energized no national movement. Proud to be in the union. I'm thankful we got somebody that's uh, standing up for us little guys. I'm just proud to be a part of the UAW. On Friday, UAW leaders called for workers at this center and 37 other auto distribution centers across the country no to join their strike, no given wheels. unsettled no negotiations. No deals. No no deals. Signs in hand. No deals. No Voices demanding to be heard. I'd like to tell the, the CFOs and the CEOs that they need to invest in us, like invest in employees. Miller reflecting on advice from his loved ones that there is strength in numbers. This is the first time that the big three has actually went out together at one time. So it's definitely a big, a big thing for us. Now, right now, these workers are receiving just about $500 in strike pay per week. They have vowed to be out here 24 seven, seven days a week until a deal is reached. In Clayton County, Brittany Ford, Atlanta News First.